Let's go to the next story here, Harrison. It's around the Chicago Bears, and is there going to be a quarterback platoon? Uh, you want to take this one? Uh, fake news Florio strikes again here, Mitch. Uh, this, this, this is a bad idea and really just reckless uh, idea spieling from both Florio and Chris Sims on NBC Sports earlier Seems to be today. Their thing. Uh, look, I get it. Foles and Trubisky, not what you're looking for in a starting quarterback, especially long term. But the idea of pff, we can't pick one, let's just play them both, Mitch. That doesn't really work. Uh, got, what's what's the old saying? You got if two you got two quarterbacks, you don't have one, and that is kind of the situation here. Now, I, I, Adam Johns, who covers the uh, the Bears uh, for the Athletics, said you know Mitch looked bet looked pretty good uh, at day two that. of training camp, and you know they're going back and forth. And Matt Nagy has said, look, we're going to alternate days here. Mitch gets first team reps one day. Uh, uh, Foles gets him the next day. This is a true competition, but don't expect this to be a two-quarterback system. That is completely out of control. Now, I don't really like Mitchell Trubisky, and I'll be honest, I don't really like Nick Foles either, but I absolutely love these deals that we got going on right now. If you need a new T-shirt, we got you covered. Go to chatsports.com slash NFL shirt. So Nike shirts up to 20% off from sizes small all the way up to, I think, 4XL. So we got you covered. If you need a new t-shirt, it's high quality as well. So if you sweat, you're not going to be able to see it. It's not the super, super cheap cotton. Very, very nice shirt. The cool thing about a lot of these, and you've seen a couple of them on screen, you've got the short sleeve high performance Nike hoodies as well. A lot of these are on sale for up to 20% off. So that link is in the comments. It's in the description. Chatsports.com slash NFL shirts. And obviously, Mitch, getting back to this, this idea of a two quarterback system coming from Florio and Sims, you got Trubisky, you got Foles. I, I switched it recently, all offseason long. I projected Foles as the starter, but since the offseason got wiped out, I, I've flipped it now. I do think Trubisky will start at least in week one and early on. And, you know, depending on how he plays, that could certainly change. But I just don't see a scenario where both guys are, are being used in different situations, right? It'd be one thing if Trubisky, yeah, he's a good athlete, but it's not like he's Taysom Hill, right? Like where <laughs> you can come in, hey, it's third and two. Let's have Mitch run a quarterback sweep. That's not really what you're looking for. So I, this is not a good idea. I don't expect this to be the case. This is, you know, they're looking for clicks, and hey, guess what? It worked because we're I mean, talking about it here on NFL this, Day. This is also the offseason where you see a lot of hype. You see a lot of people trying to create an excitement, and I've seen Mitchell Trubisky play. I'm not really worried about training camp. I've seen him play on field. Personally, for me, I'm going to say no. I'm good on both of them. I am going to go with a guy like Nick Foles. So who's the better quarterback? I'm typing NF. Harrison, what would you type? It, up to this point, it has to be NF. One guy won a Super Bowl and is 4-2 and two in the playoffs. At, you know, regular season hadn't been very good, but Trubisky hasn't been good in the regular season or the playoffs. So I'm going to go with the guy who's had playoff success. <laughs>